What is it about creepy masks and horror movies? Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for another Top 10 Horror Movie Masks. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we'll be looking at more of the most terrifying and memorable masks worn by those lovable cinematic killers, monsters, freaks, and psychos. <laughs> if you didn't see a mask you thought should be on the list, be sure to check out our first list of the Top 10 Horror Movie Masks. Number 10. The Frankenstein Mask, The Fun House Classic horror filmmaker Toby Hooper starts off our list with this carnival of terrors. The minimalist plot has a bunch of teenagers doing what they do best in 80s horror flicks, which involves lots of sex, drugs, and rowdy behavior. Maybe we'll get a little action around here. And ends up leading them to sneak into a carnival's creepy fun house to spend the night there. Let's spend the night. What? In the fun house. Clearly, that's a bad idea, and they end up witnessing the bizarre ride assistant murdering someone. Knowingly stuck with a masked murderer, the teens scramble to escape. There is little explanation at first as to why this killer is walking around wearing a Halloween mask, but we soon find out there's something more gruesome hiding underneath. <laughs> Number 9. The Owl Mask, Stage Fright, also known as Deliria. Great, go on. This sadly underseen and underappreciated slasher film is mostly recognized today for the famous owl mask the killer wears. When I catch the genius who made this headdress, I'm gonna make him eat it. The film takes place in a theater where a group of actors have locked themselves in to rehearse a musical about a serial killer named the Night Owl. This unlucky group slowly realizes that locked inside with them is an actual recent psych ward escapee and an actual serial killer. Christ, what's the night got to do with anything? <gasps> As he wears the killer's costume, which includes a huge, imposing owl's head, he honors the play's source material and goes on a killing rampage. Safe to say there will be no opening night. <laughs> Number 8. The Surgical Mask, Eyes Without a Face movie masks seem to be a more modern trope, growing in popularity with the rise of slasher flicks in the late 70s. This film's early use of a mask to convey terror harkens back to the Phantom of the Opera, showing the audience a blank, expressionless face that's hiding more sinister intentions. Our protagonist's surgical mask may be hiding her deformed face from the world, but the evil intentions are her father's, as he looks for victims whose faces he would surgically remove and give to his disfigured daughter. <laughs> Having caused the car accident that disfigured his child, the insane father will go to any lengths to give her a new face. Number 7. The Wax Mask, House of Wax Blake? What seemed like another typical teen horror flick turned out to be a surprisingly entertaining romp about a group of teenagers trying to get to a football game. Through a series of events, they all end up in a deserted town whose main attraction, the House of Wax, has a sinister past and a disturbing secret. While the clueless teens try to figure out why the wax figures seem all too real, they're stalked by two brothers who've been running this twisted wax museum. Vincent hides his disfigured face with an expressionless wax mask as he kills the innocent victims who are destined to be the future stars of his museum. Number 6. The Animal Masks. You're next. Taking a cue from the classic Wicker Man, Your Next takes innocent animal masks and transforms them into the stuff of nightmares. When a group of siblings and their partners visit their country home to celebrate their parents' anniversary, just want you all to know how much it means to us that you're all here. The party is halted by a group of killers that seem to be stalking the family. Donning lamb, fox, and tiger masks, the killers are determined to use their arsenal of weapons to take out the family members one by one. Soon enough, however, the hunters in the animal masks become the hunted. Number 5. The Sack Mask, The Orphanage. 
As a general rule, every parent should be wary of their children befriending invisible kids, especially if he says they're wearing sacks over their heads. This is what happens when Laura decides to move her family into the now defunct and incredibly creepy orphanage she grew up in. Sé que lo está pasando mal, pero quiero que sepa que vamos a hacer todo lo que esté en nuestras manos para localizar a su hijo lo antes posible. Her adopted son Simone befriends the ghostly Toma, and it's all fun and games until Simone goes missing. A plot involving a previous worker of the orphanage and the morbid history of the building unfolds in tragic waves. But ghostly little Toma and his sack mask remain the tortured centerpiece of this horror drama. No! Number four, the green mask behind the mask, the rise of Leslie Vernon. While there have been horror comedies in the past, Behind the Mask succeeds in creating something utterly unique and mesmerizing. The main subject of the film being what truly lies behind a killer's mask, this mockumentary shows us the daily life and intense preparation required to be a masked slasher killer. You gotta find a group who'll all hang together, a little from column A, a little from column B, and one survivor girl We'll tie them all together. How do you create fear with a mask and carefully timed power outages? She'll run screaming back into the house and start the panic. That gives me time to make my next move. Although the movie satirizes the lifestyle of a lonely copycat wanting to emulate his masked heroes such as Jason Voorhees or Michael Myers. It's so sadistic and yet genius. Thank you. Leslie Vernon ends up creating a believable and terrifying persona, and equally disturbing and emotionless mask. Number three, The Grinning Masks, The Purge. Any and all crime, including murder, will be legal for 12 continuous hours. With a plot that resembles a political thriller, the filmmakers took the backstory of a future America whose government has approved an annual purge and transformed it into a home invasion survival horror film. I know bad things do happen tonight, but we can afford protection, so we'll be fine just like always, no worries, okay? The Purge allows all crime to be legal, including murder, for one night only. Although wealthier households have added the ultimate insecurity to keep Purge supporters at bay, the Sandin family nevertheless becomes targets. Their attackers cannot be prosecuted during the Purge and therefore do not need to hide their faces. This makes their grinning masks even more terrifying, as they're simply used for theatricality and pure intimidation. We've gotten gussied up in our most terrifying guises as we do every year, ready to violate, annihilate, and cleanse our souls. Number two, Sam's Mask, Trick or Treat. Can you get one? The movie that revitalized the horror anthology, 2007's Trick or Treat offers a fresh variety of ghoulish stories featuring everything horror can offer, from monsters to killers to Halloween goodness. Because this is the one night that the dead all sorts of other things. Rome free. <laughs> the most memorable aspect of this cult hit, and the only thread that ties all stories together, is the mysterious little trick-or-treater, Sam. <laughs> is little Sam an ordinary kid looking for candy on Halloween? Wearing a now iconic burlap sack, and armed with a deadly lollipop, each subsequent story reveals more and more of the evil that is hiding behind those button eyes. Halloween haters, beware. Before we reveal our number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. You can't get away. <laughs> number one, the doll masks, the strangers. Is Tamara here? No. No, you got the wrong house. Home invasion films, along the lines of classic stock and slash horror flicks, are a dime a dozen, and most seem to feature some kind of scary mask. What will make a killer's mask scarier and a cut above the rest? Those four ominous words, inspired by true events. The brutal events that took place there are still not entirely known. With an incredibly simple plot ripped from the news headlines, a young couple comes back to their secluded vacation home only to realize they are not alone. Offering up more tension than gore, this thriller introduces the world to the pinup doll strangers and their bag-headed leader, who will easily be entering everyone's nightmares for a long time to come. Why are you doing this to us? 
because you were home. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.